Good morning everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and today I'm going to share with you my newly completed Ciao Bella Christmas Vibes album. This album is eight and a half by two and a half by eight and a half. Those are the outside dimensions. The pocket pages inside are eight by eight. So let's get started. So here's my cover. So I fussy cut some poinsettias out and layered them here and here. I added dimensional glue on top of the berries, which looks really pretty in person. You can see it on the camera, but not as well as in person. Then I took this image, cut out the windows, and then layered and popped the frame so you have some additional dimension here on the cover. I think it turned out lovely. Very simple spine. And here you can see where the chipboard is holding the uh, window frame up off this image in the background and just added a couple of cutouts here on the back Okay on the inside we've got this nice large pocket Which is great for storing any special Christmas cards that you receive I've got lots of cutouts that can go inside here. You can fill it full of photo frames Or photo mats. I mean, so it's a nice place to store some of the keepsakes in here, I've got photo mats, nice large five by seven photo mat. This opens up and so you've got space for photos here and here as well. Okay. No magnets. Uh, oops, I forgot to put my inserts in. Each one of the pocket pages has a nice seven and three quarter by seven and three quarter insert with um, matching edges so that as it cascades through the album you get to see a, a similar pattern all the way down which looks nice kind of unifies the book over here i fussy cut the edge following the pattern to create um, a pocket a side pocket and again there's plenty of little cut aparts and uh, elements that you can stuff full here add some photos over here i've got a pocket got my inserts and in addition, this envelope opens up and has a small little pocket with a journaling card inside. So lots of room here. Over here, we've got um, a stationary photo mat. And you've got room to slide it slightly, ever so slightly, underneath this accent piece here. In addition, this opens up to a nice large pocket for photo mats. And this is a nice place to put a five by seven. Same thing on this side. And again, each page has one of these seven and three quarter by seven and three quarter inserts. So plenty of room for photos. This is a nice, um, just a photo mat. I didn't want to cover up this image so I was very particular about what I was going to put here but you put a photo right here and this just becomes the emphasis of the page over here I fussy cut this pattern and then I've got my inserts and of course they're blank on the back so you can add, add photos or journaling to, to the back side and then our last one inserts and that pocket and then lastly over here we've got another large another large pocket so you can put lots of cards journaling cards photographs that you don't put in the album keepsake cards from christmas so that is it for um Chabella's christmas vibes and i think it turned out cute um i really like the paper these birds are super duper cute so yeah, so we'll have these matching and I, I did both sides. So whether it's cascading um, away from you or to the um, left hand side, you'll see this um, matching trim, which like I said, unifies the book. You don't have to do it that way. That's just kind of my style aesthetic. So even if the um, patterns are very different each page, this little strip sort of brings it all back together. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'd love to hear your comments. This is available in stock right now. I used a 12 by 12 collection pack, a 12 by 12, I think they call it 
pattern pack, an A4 and an eight by eight. So that's what I used in this album. I think it turned out lovely. Um, and this is a good, this is a good starter album. It's not too complicated. So if you haven't made an album and you're looking for a place to jump in, this might just be it. As always, thanks for tuning in. This is Daphne from Scrapping Create. See you soon.